So now what we're gonna see is what, what else can this be, right? I draw back and then I went forward. So he goes one, two, I'm skirting up behind the head. Now I can hit up and then go behind the head or I can just hit low, that brings him down and then go behind the head, right? Now remember, this hand went back as it struck and went through. Instead of it going back to strike, what is gonna happen is I'm just gonna bring this over. And you see how that turns his head? Now if he's in perfect condition and I haven't hit him in the face and hit him in his body or poked him in the eye or something like that, he could do some stuff, obviously. He's got that out of hand, right? But what I'm saying is that I'm probably gonna, this is gonna be lightning fast. I'm gonna occupy him with some of the things that I've done, right? So now I'm moving from here to here. Once I get here, you see how he's loaded in this arm right here? All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring this arm out and this arm, this arm this way and this forearm that way. And what that's gonna do is that's pull him down. Two, hit, up, right? Thumb to eye, whatever the case may be, then scoop it, right? Pressing, if you want to do compliance, I'm going to use these fingers to press right in the gap of his neck. It feels uncomfortable for him. Then I roll, then I press through, right? One, two, up, here. Roll them, back, step, down. Right? Hyperextend or break that spine. Then I have stuff that I can do from there. This is my first strike. This is the clear in strike. Then this hand goes up behind his neck. And then I go around or to my next strike, my third strike. So my one, two, three which is essentially one, two, hooking the neck, three, the scooping action. Then we add the extra piece at the end, right? But really the extra piece at the end is me resetting, but not just resetting, one, two, Three, this resetting. If you think about this hand scooping through and this one coming out, it's kind of like me going right for the next piece of the puzzle. So now we're learning how this applies to what it is that we are trying to accomplish, right? With sticks and without sticks, right? So that's what we're looking for. Thank <laughs> you.